and the size of that uh, interruption but i was going to go to james riley uh, james in the uh, finicale manifesto it says absolutely clearly that unilaterally finicale will require the, the junior bondholders uh, to bear some of the burden of the bank debt and it says it says explicitly it would do this unilaterally are you serious I think we've been very clear what our position is on this issue. Yes, you have. In, in your manifesto, yeah. it's very clear. We've but I'm asking, are you serious? Say, sorry, first of all, you know, unilateral and, and there, there, there's a two-way street here. Yeah, so but let's why, put you, why are you saying no, unilateral for then? then? I'll answer the question if you allow me. Okay, okay. go ahead. Sorry, uh, it made it very clear that European banks lent recklessly to Irish banks who lent recklessly to Irish developers. That was not our sovereign debt. That's a banking debt. Mm -hmm. Our sovereign debt, Ireland will honour in the future. In relation to the other debt, there is 10 billion in subordinated junior debt. There is 15 billion of unguaranteed <coughs> senior debt. That has to be negotiated in our view. And furthermore, I make this point, it will be done in the context of Europe, it will be done in the context of our partners, but it will be done on the background of, yes, Europe has been good to Ireland and given us over 70 billion, but yes, Europe took over 100 billion out of our fisheries James, also. James, so we will sit down with my point with our about European the partners. statement that you will act unilaterally. As stated in the manifesto, you will act unilaterally with regard to requiring the junior bondholders to share the pain. We are going to insist that junior bondholders share some of the pain. So you will act unilaterally. But that's not unilateral. We will sit down and negotiate. You can't. But you, 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 you said you're saying unilaterally. Sorry, excuse me. You, you said me. what you, you said. You the word unilaterally. Show me no, in the manifesto. No, I'm sorry. Where that I'm sorry. I'm, uh, yes, it's given in the past, so I'll, I'll find it to you. Yeah. Right. Absolutely. Give me the past. Right. What I would say to you is that the word unilaterally means on one side. So there's two sides yes. in this. Yes, so it's so the you right it does. Yeah. That there has to be a negotiation. And so there's, but I mean, it's from the position of strength of the negotiation <laughs> that you sit down and you have your negotiation. So we're very clear that subordinated debt does not have the same right as senior debt, and senior debt of itself doesn't have the same right as guaranteed senior debt. And when it comes to the bank guarantee, we made it very clear we felt it was far too extensive, and we did not want, it, it, it covered far more than it should have. So we're quite happy to go back and renegotiate okay, this. Okay, you want to redefine the unilateral reference, yeah. yeah go ahead. Um, Fine Gael and government will force certain classes, force certain classes of bondholders to share in the cost of recapitalizing troubled financial institutions, this will be done unilaterally for the most junior bondholders, owners of preference shares, subordinated debt, and similar instruments, but could be extended as, as part of the European wide framework for senior debt. That's the reference yes. to unilaterally. You will do this unilaterally. Don't say yes. it's not in the manifesto. There it is. No, I have Page to it, and that's fine. And okay, I'll, 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 quite, I'll, I'll, I'm quite happy to stand over that. I have no problem with that. There it is, James. Smart, there it is. And I'll, 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 I'll circle the word unilaterally. There it is. Thank you very much, Richard. Can I, can I, just say I think it's very clear. And that's, and, and it is, yeah, very clear. You said yeah. it wasn't. Say, you, you denied it was the word unilaterally was there. I didn't deny it. You did. I said, I asked you to show it to me in the manifesto. Well, I've done that so too. Yeah. Read it, I've done that too. That's now, fine. are you serious that you would act unilaterally with that in that regard? We're absolutely serious that we would sit down and insist that the well, subordinated <laughs> bondholders would take the hit yeah. and share the burden. Yeah. Yeah. Share yeah. You're, you're, avoiding, you're avoiding the implication of the word unilaterally. There still, there and still this is a part of scruffing. And that the people who vote for Fine Gael on the basis that you will act unilaterally in requiring junior bondholders to accept parts of the debt are, are mistaken in the, belief in, the, in the belief that you're going to do this. You won't. We have stated very clearly mm -hmm. that we're going to insist on that. Now, if that's, but and it says unilaterally, and if it says force, we will insist. We will insist on that, yes.